what's up team this is my new colognes got a lot in the bathroom now marco or oh, mark echo this is blue mark echo blue i got this on right now it's my good baby you smell it i don't smell mm -hmm. it mm -hmm. it's really unique how it smell it's not good yeah and this this came as a bonus with this what is that one? This is that one? Mark Echo too. Hey, go ahead, smell you like said that. it smells so good, so I want to see how it smells. Yeah, it smells good. And this is here, just put a little, a little, a little bit on there. Hmm. I think I like the blue better. You're right, the blue is better. Yeah. The blue is better. He and this is Wings, this is my favorite. That's I'm, what we, we keep buying. Don't spray that on me. I want to smell you, it. No, so you spray it where you want to. Don't spray that on me. I already got two smells on me. You already know what wings smell like. I just got so used to it on you. You're my you wing dealer. It? You can't smell it? I think I like this out of all of them better. I don't forgot what wings smell like. Oh, I'm sorry. Did I get that from the plane? No, I'm going to have to spray this on the wall. Let me see that. Mm, yeah. I think I like this one, but then I like this the second, and then that the last. Yeah. Matter of fact, this must be what he had on, cause this smell fresh and clean. This don't smell like something I smelled yesterday. Yeah. I think I like the Adidas better too. What about the Adidas thing I got you? Yeah, the Adidas is good too, baby. Yeah, I like uh, uh, the Adidas. Smell good for men. Yeah, I got my husband some of that for Christmas. Yes. And she used to buy all my wings, y'all. But now I gotta buy my own wings. Just, just time. Just, just well, time. you know, team. Don't believe the hype because I'm the girl that just brought him this. Yeah, she did buy that. Team. Yeah, she bought the makeup for that. Is she bought those team. Consider, I told him consider a late Christmas gift because I had to buy all those kids something. Yeah, and my parents, my sisters. So I kind of pushed baby back on the back burner, only because. You feel you know, like that was fair. No, I got, I got you something. I'm, I'm, I'm number one. I'm, I'm numero yeah, I, I uno. Got him, I got him one gift. I come before everybody. One good everybody. gift. That's all that matters. But, uh, you know, because I had to get everybody else something. But he brought me a lot of gifts. I come before everybody. I think he spent like his whole check on me or something. Most of his check when he got paid. He spent no whole check on you now. Well, don't, well. don't tell the people that now. Spending my whole check on no woman. Look good, you know that. All right, team. We're gonna get back up in a few minutes. I'm gonna take these and put them in the bathroom. Add them to the family. So babe likes wings better. Wings is my signature cologne. It just smell good. I've been wearing wings. Let me tell you how I found out about wings. I was living in North Carolina. I went to this store. I was way in the back of the store, getting a beer, in the beer section at the refrigerator. There was this Caucasian young guy at the counter, at the front of the store. The scent traveled. It traveled. That's why they call it wings. It traveled. So I went to him, now you know guys, we don't really be like, hey bro, what you wearing? But I went up to him, I went, I caught him outside. He went out, he was already outside. No, no, I caught him at the register. I'm like, hey man, what is that you wearing? He said, wings. He said, I got a little bit left of the bottle if you want to buy it off of me. And I bought, I bought it off him for $5. It was like, like with my finger add on down. I bought, he gave me the rest of that for $5. So I've been wearing wings ever since. That was 1998. I've been wearing wings since 98. But it didn't become my signature until, hey, when you started buying it? 2016? When you started buying it for me, 2016 or 17? 2016, y'all. I heard her feelings, y'all, I dumped her. But anyway, I ain't gonna keep throwing that at y'all because then y'all gonna wanna know the whole story, why I dumped her, why I got rid of her. I kicked her to the curb, y'all. I kicked her to the, I, I cut you loose. I cut you loose. I'm not gonna lie to y'all. Can I just be honest? She was dead to me. But you, I cut but her you loose. But you were still in my inbox. 
I was in her inbox giving her advice for her ministry. Nope. I was done with him. Yeah, we had broke up. I was done with uh Who let Sean. tell him who let who go. We both let each other go. No, no, can I can no, I come on be honest with the people? No, I'm being honest. No, I, I let you go. We come hung on, up. We 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 cross words. No. And I, you, I got you said bye, you. I'll talk to you later. I got rid of you. Tell them the truth. How do you get rid of me? Tell them back. How? Them back. I don't remember that. I just know that I was truth. done and we didn't talk for about three days, <sighs> four days. And then he was in I'm my gonna, inbox. I'm going to tell you all the real he kept stuff. Being, you haven't going to talk about this. I'm gonna tell he kept being in my stuff. inbox no. telling me. And I'm I was a, like, I'm I'm I wanted her to inbox you. telling her something to help her ministry. Come on, get out of here. But okay, if you're done with somebody, why keep messaging them? Right? That ain't nothing. Well, if, if I'm done with you, I'm, I'm not going to be messaging you no more. You so message me back. Every, every maybe like, I think for the whole month of August, I think 2016, we broke up. And then every few days, he'll message me. He will always initiate it. He said, Woman of God, pray for me. Woman of God, this. I think this will look good. I just felt like you was just trying to get my attention. I really wasn't. I'm being honest with y'all. I okay. really wasn't. So why would you come to somebody for prayer if you know they don't like you? If you know that they didn't want to have anything to do with you? Because we ain't got to like each other for you to pray for me. Come on. I, I don't know, team. I ain't got to like you. Up. I ain't got to like up because none of y'all for me to pray for you. Because, you know, we both are strong. We both can be stubborn. I'm going to be honest with you. And it was the, I let her go. It was the wrong season. I let her yeah. go, y'all. That's that's the truth right there. If you want to know the truth, okay, I let her go. And then, you know, one time we stopped talking, and then and then, and then look, he was she in my inbox. She ain't again. being honest with y'all when she came for the photo shoot. Look, I wasn't thinking about no photo shoot. She just wanted to see me. That's not true. You told you told me that played a major part. Now get out of here. You wanted to see me. Tell them the truth, man. Come on, I need you to be a honest little with bit. Thing. You didn't want to sit me. Thank you. Babe, but you initiated my photo Thank shoot. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, we're going to tell you the story. <sighs> What's up, team? The day me and Pumpkin got up late. And lazy. And trained. Yes. Y'all know the longer y'all stay in bed, the worse it get. When I originally woke up this morning, I was all right. The more I laid there, it seemed like the tide I got. Anyway, working on a magazine today. And y'all should see that commercial. Matter of fact, y'all should see that commercial in this video. As a matter of fact, let me just go ahead and show it to y'all right now. Stay tuned. Choice essential. A choice essential. One day I was worshiping and I saw the magazine in the spirit. A choice essential. A choice essential is an online Christian magazine. Every month we feature different ministries in the body of Christ. Our aim is to encourage, enlighten, and win souls for the kingdom. This magazine has prophecy, natural hair care, fashion, healthy living, powerful testimonies, anointed books, poetry, and more and more. This month we have no other than we're also featuring To place your ad in our magazine, you can contact us at rejoiceessential at gmail.com. Follow us on Facebook at Rejoice Essential Magazine, and you can also find us on azoo.com. Look for new issues on the first of every month. First of every month. First of every month. What's up, team? So you guys, I just got off Periscope. Uh, I taught about false prophets. Yeah, so it's very interesting. Uh, the glory of God started manifesting. And uh, someone got saved. Praise God. And yeah, <laughs> I said I'm going back to the basics and start preaching Jesus more and offering an altar call. Even though it's on Periscope. It, and then... I think like two people got healed. So God is good. So I'm, I'm very thankful. 
his presence was so strong. Uh, you know, just a little while ago and I had to just calm down. Yeah. So anywho, um, I did not get a chance to do, uh, reading with my son tonight. We didn't read. Yeah. I'm making my son, uh, where's that book? Let me show the team. Yeah. He hates to read to me, but I'm making him read this brave wilderness. You guys, I love this show. Um, yeah, so we're on like halfway through the book. Yeah, so it's kind of, it got big words in there for a third grader. That's why I make him read it. Yeah, so. Yes, yeah, so we didn't get a chance to read um, his homework today, but we'll do it tomorrow. Yeah, because tomorrow we uh, got an hour to kill because Mariah has... Uh, the science project she's working on. So, yeah, for the next few Wednesdays, it's going to be busy. Um, yeah, so I think I'm getting ready to do my toenails team. Yeah, I don't know what color you like your toenails to be, but this is my color. Bay loves some red toenails on me, so. <laughs> I think I'm going to paint my toenails red and, yeah, and see what he'd say about it. And I'm gonna put my feet on his lap, like hi, babe, with some polished toes. Let's see what he say, team. <laughs> you gonna say get them off? No, you're not. You gonna love my feet. Get he them. actually rubs my feet, you guys. He just tried to front, yeah. But in, in private, he be, he loves them. He he rubs my mm. feet. <laughs> yeah. You tell them people anything. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you guys. So. I'm reading uh, God's Generals, and I think last night I read like two chapters. I'm like, oh, and I had to go to bed, so <laughs> so I got to get up so early in the morning. But I think I'm gonna finish my book, uh, God's Generals. Try to read at least a chapter tonight, and try to just study, get in the Word, and study something. Yeah. What up, team? What's up, team? Love you guys. Early in the morning. Early, team. Just have to go to the ATM for a second. Ghetto ATM, all they have is ten dollar bills. That's cool. So it's like if you only got fourteen, fifteen dollars, you can get some money. Yeah, that's true. I ain't think about it like that. <laughs> all these darn wrong pins. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah. So we just dropped the kids off, and uh, we're gonna go back to. The so we're done. Got to work on the magazine today. Yeah. Starting yeah. working at and yeah, um Valentine's Day next month. So I gotta put something in there about love. It's gonna, be, it's gonna be nice, it's gonna be a nice article. A nice issue, I mean. Ooh. Yes, it's bright, it's not just cute. So guys I, I feel like I look some kind of way with getting like a gorgeous and like
too. So we are at the house. Let me turn around so I can put my boom in. Open. Like a gentleman should. I'm a gentleman. You know what? No, no man taught me that. The open doors for women. You know where I got that from? TV. So believe it or not, TV and music has a big impression on you. And I know I said this before, but my wife ain't gotta touch no doors. I'm not allowed to team. Unless I get mad. No, I'm joking. My wife ain't gotta touch no doors. My mother ain't gotta touch no doors. My sister, well, she don't listen to me. She go ahead and touch the door. You cut my laugh. Put me on blast and tell the team everything. <laughs> I can't wait till it get hot, you guys. I'm ready to wear my spring dresses. Thanks, babe. Thanks. You're welcome, gorgeous. <laughs> yeah, we live in the country, as you see. It's nothing back there. Yeah. It's cold out here. Thanks, babe, for letting me in first. Okay. Anyway, well, y'all, y'all know the song that says, let's go back to eat and live on top of the world. My babe was singing this. She was saying, let's go back to Egypt. I'm like, babe, we going back to Egypt. <laughs> Anyway, guys, today is going to be a good day. It's going to be a beautiful day. I forgot I got some, um, damn, what you call that? I got some root beer. Is it? I forgot, I think it's root beer. Anyway. Sit y'all down for a second. I think this will be. Mm. Don't give them the account of money. <laughs> Ten. Hope y'all enjoying the videos. Hope y'all enjoying the vlogs, the messages. I pray y'all enjoying Testimony Tuesday. I think we we heard some powerful testimonies so far. If you haven't seen Testimony Tuesday, go look for those videos here on our channel. Testimony Tuesday. I pray y'all enjoying my wife and our videos as well. The vlogs, the ones she did um called I thought they were the one. And then some other ones coming. As far as my videos by myself, check out single ladies. Check out if you have not watched it, check out the video. He'll find you. I think you'll enjoy that video. He'll find you. Anyway, me and Punkin about to get in the word. So talk to y'all later, team. What's up, team? Sitting in my new office chair. Babe got me. We got two matching chairs. And Babe, uh, it feels really comfortable. Yeah, it feels really, really good. Babe is in the living room um, putting everything together. You guys, I'm so tired. <laughs> I just woke up and um, I'm going to go ahead and go get uh, Mom Mom. And me and him are going to read for an hour in the car while we wait for a sister to get out of her, um, she's staying at the school to build a science project. So I'm so excited that she's participating in extracurriculum activities. So yeah, so babe is doing a good job. Um, we have office, like office desk coming too. Um, two office desks coming. So when those come here to put those together. So shout out the Tron team, shout out the Tron. So we're going to officially show you guys our office, our complete office. 
yeah, right now it's kind of kind of messy because we, we need like some space. We need like more uh, cubby things and storage units, you know, because I have we have a lot of I have a lot of books. You know, I need like another bookshelf. Um, I have a lot of documents, a lot of papers. So, yeah, we're going to we gonna have to get a file cabinet and a bunch of stuff, you know, and then we want to decorate the office, too. And we're going to show you that, guys, when it's complete. Um, we're. When I was in Colorado, I was so sad, you guys, because I had to throw away, like, one of those fake plants. I had one, and I couldn't take it with me because if, you, if you've been following me from the get-go, you see that I packed up my car. You know, I think the name of the vlog is Coming Home or Going Home or something like that. And it's on my channel. Um, but, yeah, it was an emotional moment for me. Like, my car is really small, you guys, and I packed it, to the, packed it up to the max. Yeah. And I drove from Colorado to North Carolina. It took like 20, like 25 hours. Like, so I did it in like two days. It was, whew, it was, yeah, it was like wear and tear on my body. But anywho, yes, yeah, so I'm believing for more plants, like artificial plants and flowers and just more pictures and stuff to put on the wall. And me and baby, like, uh, they got some nice pictures, like black and white, uh, the blue, like something blue, like the hue colors, like the blues. Um, yeah, so that's the color that we like. So yeah, I can't wait for you guys to see everything come together. So babe did another chair. He completed another chair. Yeah. So you guys, I mean, it's hard working. Yeah, he did really good. Really, really good. Working hard, putting these chairs together. For our, our, our office, we're gonna put it together like I told you guys. So we love you guys. It's been real. It's been fun. You know, we thank you guys for watching us on this journey. We're going to start to do more things. You know, if you got any decorating tips or anything that you would like to give us, hey, you know, feel free to comment below. Um, I know my sister told me about pin Pinterest, getting ideas for rooms, stuff like that, because her house is the bomb. But anyways, I'm not a decorator. Babe is more, he, I, I leave it up to him and you guys can help us. So, yeah. Anyway, we talk to you soon. Still, sis.